Good afternoon, good morning, good evening, my Sims people. Welcome to my Sims Entertainment channel. Uh, as you know, here we do Let's Plays and Speed Builds. Today we will be doing a Let's Play Episode 2. We are here again with the Morrison Reese family and catching you up quickly on last episode's drama. We need a stove. As you can see, our burnt art piece in the middle of the kitchen needs to be replaced. Um, the goal for this episode really is to try and replace the stove if possible. And I'm also going to show you guys a little bit of how I make money when I quickly need it. Uh, in The Sims through... Yeah, you figured it out. Gardening. <laughs> gardening uh i think gardening is such a quick way to make money and um that's what we're gonna do here today uh, daryl was and let me get these names straight again i think i confuse myself because the dad's name is daryl and the son's name is dante and i think i just call all the men dante but dad is daryl um son is dante mom is jasmine daughter is Kylie? Riley, 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 Riley. Let's see what's going on here. F uh, foundation. Today is love day. So dad is really going to have to bring his A game today to see if he gets a spot in bed with mom rather than slipping on the bunk beds, which is where he has called his bedroom the kids room so far so let's see if mom and dad have any kind of spark and hopefully they do and at least they can share a bed having spark and being able to share a bed does not determine the rest of their relationship it just means that they play nice enough to share a bed together um what is mom doing i'm guessing she is doing a little web work uh, yeah, because she hasn't finished up her daily task for today. And the kids are just hanging out outside, I guess. What are they up to? What time is it? Okay, so it's afternoon time and they've come from work. School and work. Mom came from school and they came from work. And Dante, as usual. I don't know why the front of the house is like his favorite place in the world. But he's if you can't find Dante, he's probably in the front of the house. It looks like Riley is telling mom all about her day and what happened at school. Riley is pretty good at school. Dante is catching up a bit. Um, yeah, and it looks like she's doing her schoolwork and talking to mom and Dante's joining her in that mission um yeah and dad is at work with a half finished painting and food on the counter that always seeing food on the counter and then knowing that it's worse it always bugs me and i try my best to not just take it and put it in the sink and actually have them do it and it looks like i'm gonna have mom do it and <laughs> I'm not just going to put it in the sink this time around, this time, but there's going to be a lot of times where I'm just like, whatevs. But, um, the stove, our burnt piece of art in the middle of the kitchen right now, cost 2700 and so far, it looks like we have $3,015, so... Technically, this would have been a good time to buy the stove, but I get a feeling that I'm probably not going to buy the stove because we're going out for a love day and we want a little kachingish there or probably while it's playing. I forgot, but look, it looks like that is home and he's shooting his shot, man. He's trying to shoot his shot, trying to see it. Mom's going to bite, you know, he, he got he to gotta do his best because... It's not cute being a grown man in a bunk bed. Like, nothing is cute about that. So, Dad is out here giving love gifts. He is trying everything. Talk dirty, do everything. Everything to get the goal is to be comfortably in this beautiful, I'm going to say queen size bed. Queen size. I'm going to give it queen size because this is not a king size bed. Um, 
that the kids Ooh. are seeming to enjoy one of them at least per night and it's usually riley enjoying <laughs> nights uh in this bed daddy's desperately trying to get into this bed i think the family really likes this room honestly they spend a lot they don't spend much time in the living room or in the dining room well i don't really have a dining room the open space in the front of the house so the living room and at the the counter the kitchen counter they don't do that um riley's like yeah I've heard enough. I'm done. <laughs> Get me out of here. Ah, I'm chool, not chool. about that life. And it looks like she bite and they're going on a date. Now, first I thought I was going to do a cute date in um, Mont... I can't remember his name. But, you know, the place that came with no escape. And then I'm like, ooh, let me try out 10 minutes. Menosino. I don't know if I'm pronouncing that right. Uh, and I ended up at a karaoke bar because oh. I didn't want to do anything so? too fancy, but I wanted to make keep it fun and light. Oh, so man. we're at the karaoke bar, and as per usual, I'm trying to follow all the suggestions for how to have a proper date. So it says uh, you have to socialize ten times, sit together, and flirt with your date. So. That's pretty much what I'm going to try to follow to see if he can get a gold, a gold, um, gold, I guess it's gold, gold performance in, um, uh, for this date. And, well, they've sat down, so that's good. And the next one is tell your date a story. Yeah. And see if that can, what's going to go on with them. And spoiler alert, I haven't introduced her yet. But this on the side here in the blue crop top acting out is Giov Genevieve Giovanni. This is Genevieve and this is another sim that I've created and she is in their world together. She lives in San Manicino, San Manicino and she lives in an apartment and soon to come I'm going to show you the apartment that I built for her. Hers is not a starter home which is also fun. Um, I have her further along. I have I started her journey of Sims further along, so I'm not starting off with her. So I gave her extra money, and she had a backstory to her as to how she came to live in the, uh, in the city and what she wants to do. She's single, so she's an only Sim. And whoa! Meanwhile, mom and dad looks like they're really going to hit it off excuse me excuse me and this is with those of you who are not familiar with this mod this is wicked whims and mom and dad are wicked women <laughs> whims in <laughs> but um yeah it looks like they like each other so at least we know they will be sharing a bed that is i think they've had they have enough to pretty much share a bed and yeah we're gonna leave mom and dad at that that situation but um that's good news for them listen to this guy meanwhile mom and dad getting it on in the bathroom this guy is <laughs> singing his heart out <laughs> karaoke night um yeah but this is just a little teaser i'm so happy she was in the bar i was so happy that um oh i keep forgetting her name <laughs> Genevieve was in the house in in the bar, so it's soon to come. You're gonna see uh, more with her, including Let's Play. She's a sim that I had when Stony Escape came out, so you're gonna see Let's Play of her in Stony Escape, uh, in Mount Mount whatever came with Stony Escape, and um, yeah, in her uh, apartment build pretty soon. Um, but yeah, it seems that after this. <laughs> After a workout, Dad is hungry, so he is having a snack, and I have no idea Daryl is having a snack. You can't call them mom and dad in situations like that. You need to use their government names, Daryl and Jasmine. <laughs> we have no idea where Jasmine is. Um, oh, there she goes. And they're going to be having a snack together. And if you can hear in the background, you hear all the singing from karaoke, which is really funny. Like Some of them are good, and some of them are just like, okay, let's work on that a bit. Um, and it's good. They're getting along. 
good to see. They, they, they've gotten down and dirty, but they haven't had their first kisses yet. Interesting. Since this is always the clash between the base game and the the options that you get of the base game, and then the options that you get when you add mods in, it's always funny. It's like, yeah. <laughs> so it's, yeah. They're, they seem to be getting along fine, and I like this because also, if you realize when they first started to interact with each other, it wasn't a situation where you had to like feel each other out. I think they they liked each other because he he was already flirtatious when he came into the house, and she quickly got flirtatious afterwards. I'm thinking this is where they became boyfriend and girlfriend. Not sure. And then they're gonna have their first kiss. Um, yeah. Hooray! <laughs> it's like, what? She, look at her being coy. Right, Jasmine, Jasmine. Daryl, Daryl, please. Uh, but I'm really happy that this, uh, worked out with them. And it seems to be working out really well. They have no idea it is <laughs> 1047. Where are your children at? They don't know, but they know they got a thing going on here. Now, like I said, I, I think I need some boyfriend and girlfriend. I'm not sure. But that doesn't, you know, you know what I say, unless you're engaged. That doesn't necessarily mean these are the people that they're going to end up with for the rest of their lives and build happy families. That just means for now. They are Boo and Boo Boo together. Um, yeah, they spend a little bit of time at this karaoke place. I think karaoke place was a good start as a first date. It wasn't like too much and it was just chilled and relaxed. But, um, I think Love Day is going pretty well for these two. Oh. Update is going for oh this guy is still at it he is still at it trying to get on american idol here oh my god they did not come into the man's karaoke room to do their business daryl jasmine what is this and look at these people walking all over them i can't i can't deal with them they're too much like stop it you two jeez you're in you're going to sleep in that bed like stop look at you jasmine out here in public with no clothes on mm -mm. girl yeah and there goes i'm gonna remember her name i am going to make it a mission to remember her name genevieve i released the video and genevieve wasn't even her name but i'm pretty sure her name is Genevieve. Look at her, she's out here like many outfits in. Like, what is going on here? Genevieve also has, uh, I like, I will explain more about her career and her life and her backstory when I release this story, but it's gonna be a lot. Fun. I like playing with her a lot because it's very different from your two parent, two kids child. It's different, it's a different um, experience, obviously. Um, it's getting late and y'all got work in the morning and we got a stove to buy. So what are you two doing with your life? <laughs> yeah, it's time to go home. Oh, there, now you're enjoying the entertainment. Oh, a second ago, you had the entertainment running out of the room. But now you're enjoying the entertainment. Um... Okay, so this is where I'm going to, I believe I'm going to show you how I start a garden. So I usually, I find this, it's not the grocery um, booth where you can buy grocery isn't always in the same place. I don't think so. And you can't always get it like all the time. So for example, you can't get it at festivals and stuff like that. You have to wait for an hour where like nothing much is going on in that part of San Minichino in order to get it. But it looks like they're open tonight, and you can you can go to the stall and get as much produce course, no, as you like, yes. and that is exactly what I'm gonna have Jasmine do is get a bunch of produce. I think the first time I did it, I'm not I'm not a hundred percent sure. I, I this episode is not where I build the garden. I think I do it next episode. I think for this episode, I just got more stuff for them to eat because they don't have a stove. So. 
and all these produce and candies and stuff you get from this produce stand you can eat it without having to cook it or anything like that i'm just going to pick up a few things that i can have in the fridge or in the kids inventory if they get hungry and they can make salads out of this uh, if you have apples well apples will give you a uh, an apple salad but my apple salads are it's a modification it's a mod that i get from iceman Mun, which is a mod that i highly highly recommend so some of the things that you're seeing here is not from the base game like the broccoli and the cabbage it's not from the base game the uh, grapes this version of grapes is not from the base game um but iceman Mun gives you so many amazing harvestables and it's not just like oh i randomly have broccoli in my game he also, he or she, I don't know who the creator is, <laughs> but um, the creator also gives you recipes with these things. So you see cocoa beans here and there are so many different um, chocolate recipes that you can make out of the cocoa beans. And you don't need the harvestables also in order to make the recipes, but I like no, to do things the harder way. So usually when I do my downloads, I do it with harvestable. Uh, I need where I would need the things for the recipe in order to make the recipe. And this is how you get it. You can get it from other places as well. You can get it off your computer um, if you go to orders and stuff like that. Um, but I like to, I'm gonna, I believe this time around, I got this stuff to put in the fridge. In order for them to have something to eat because they don't have a stove so they have to everything coming out cold oh. and then coming out warm from <laughs> this this house y'all gonna y'all on struggle bus right now and she just spent a bunch of money like i prior to this date i had money to buy a stove after the date i don't have money to buy the stove so the chronicles they they go on um it looks like the kids are home chilling i mean like it's one o'clock. It's one o'clock in the morning, and they're not even sleeping. And their parents were just like, "Yeah, that was just like I'm trying to get into a bed." So y'all, <laughs> take self care. Take care of yourselves. You are eleven, I believe, are is the age for children. I think it's seven to eleven is a child's age in Sims, and I don't know why this fall. But I mean, don't even look like they're. He went straight into making that painting. Yes, Daryl, we need that money. We need <laughs> this black fixture needs to get out of my kitchen. My kitchen is so beautiful, and then it just has this black fixture in it right now. Um, what is Riley up to? Is she sleeping? No, she is on the floor doing her homework or eating. What is Riley up to? I have no idea. What is she doing? I can't see from this vintage point what she's doing. And Dante is hopefully going to bed. No. Nope. No, not not an option today. Melba. He, oh, he's gonna he's gonna talk to his dad. He is going to have a conversation with his father about his day. Riley spoke to mommy about her day, and Dante is talking to daddy about his day. Um, yeah, they're being pretty. Nothing extraordinary Jarjuke. is happening Zara -Zara. with them. I think Riley might be doing her homework, actually. Because I don't... Oh, uh, maybe journaling? I'm not sure. Glass. It's just weird because I this new thing where they bend down and you can't really see them. Okay. So, yeah. I'm putting Dar Dante to bed. You see what I mean? <laughs> Always mistaken the two. And, um... Riley doesn't seem like... Oh, yep. I was right. She was doing her homework. And she doesn't even seem like she wants to sleep. <laughs> this is me trying to see if I can afford the stove. We gotta do everything we can. Go sell that painting. Like, don't come out here talking to your son knowing that we need a stove. Sell the painting. Sell the painting. Um, yeah, he, so he has social butterfly as his achievement goals and these are really i like to do them because the perks are also help like they're helpful there are really nice things in there what i love to do for adult sims is get i believe you need either five thousand points or seven thousand or maybe ten thousand points to get the money tree and child when i tell you <laughs> the money tree is where it's at so that's why I, always, I try to get reach my gold sometimes and I'm gonna do it with the kids so that they can get it from childhood but I haven't been very active with that and I 
I'm not a huge fan of the social the the social butterfly one I did was honestly to challenge myself because when I build sims I always especially families I'll have them like socialize and be friendly with each other and rather than meeting other people and I need to do a better job at that with them. Okay, so here they go, like I was complaining about last episode. There are monsters under the bed. They have to go get their parents. And everybody had a long night. And it's 5 o'clock in the morning. And mm, Mama woke up on a good night. Dad, as you can see, is sleeping in bed. He made his way to the bedroom. Um, so she, he, he better keep her happy. Because if not, he's going <laughs> to sleep with the monsters. That's what's, that's really what's going to happen to him. But it looks like mom dealt with the monsters and now mom is ripe. So she needs to take a shower and get ready for work. Hopefully she finished her daily task yesterday. I'm not 100% sure. But we're going to stop for mom pretty soon. And um, Dante, time to go to bed, boy. Get a little sleeping. You see? And if you go to cook, like, what am I going to do? Cook, have breakfast. Yeah. As you can see, like, a bunch of stuff is going to be missing from here. Even though she can make it, she doesn't have a stove. So her options are fruit salad. <laughs> That's pretty much what they're limited to without a stove. So this is going to be a yummy fruit salad because they have a bunch of... I bought a bunch of fruits. But, yeah, it's going to be struggle bus for a minute gonna be struggle bus for a minute here Dante does not seem to want to go back to bed but he's I'm fine with that and Riley yeah. out here playing with her dolls yes that is what is happening <laughs> Okay, yeah. It looks like Dante's hungry, and the kids. The good thing about it is, without a stove, the kids can get quick, quick meals, and they're not the best in the world. They're like applesauce, animal crackers, and what Dante's having now, peas. Oh my gosh! So, this hair that Jasmine is wearing, I love it. I I really do love it. But the fact that she goes bald when she's not this close to the camera can sometimes get frustrating. It looks like. Riley's a smart one. She got up and she was just like, I'm snatching the leftovers. <laughs> she sure did. She sure did snatch the leftovers. And yeah, we broke as hell, Dad. You can't be hanging these paintings in the sky. Sell it. Sell it. We need money. <laughs> Immediately. I want my stove. <laughs> Let's see how far am I away from it? Okay, 2,500. <laughs> I'm desperately checking because i need i need my stove yeah but you see how it goes far and you can't really see it and it looks like a nice boy cut i won't even lie and then you go close up and you see that her she actually has hair it's because it looks okay without it that i keep using it i think this, the hairstyle is so cute um yeah but everybody this, this it's everybody's rationing right now Dante just had some peas Riley came downstairs looking like a queen because <laughs> look at her double head. I don't know why her head does that when she, nothing on her is CC. I don't know. It's, if you have any suggestions or if this happens to your Sims, let me know. Like nothing, not even the couch is CC. I don't even understand why it's doing that. It's like a, it's a chuck. I do not have a chuck, yo. Yeah, mom is out here. Even probably fruits. That just made a meal. And he does this a lot. Dante does this a lot. Daryl does this a lot. He makes meals and he doesn't eat them. He just leaves them there. I don't know why. He's probably trying to get his skills up as a chef. I swear, I think maybe he's a perfectionist. He always goes to paint without me even asking him to paint. Which is good because it gets his daily task up pretty pretty well even when i forget but sometimes i'm like where's that Maybe else and he's painting. yeah I'd be like where's daryl i need him to do something else and he's painting so i don't know i kind of um 
came away from my computer mic so I wasn't sure if that last comment registered and that's why I was repeating myself um, there's a really weird effect that's going to happen pretty soon in the game that I want you guys to see and it's going to happen if Dante when he uses the bathroom oh by the way the so right now there's an upgrade for the sims for skin tones and I took out slice of life because it wasn't working properly and I realized there are so many options like that when you click on stuff to to and the different things to do that actually did come from slice of life so right now I'm really missing it so like the poop option which I use all the time for my sims I don't know why as you know why because it's funny and they fart when they do it look at Dante's face doesn't he look like a ghost in the mirror like if you can pause the video do that and just look at his face in that mirror he looks like a ghost it's so weird it is yeah I saw it once I saw it and then I tried to do a meme of it but it wasn't really working out because his little plum bot was getting bob was getting in the way but it's so I don't know what causes that if it's because when you know how they wash their hands and the steam comes up so it's like the steam in front of them with the mirror it looks really weird but when Dante looks into that mirror he looks like a little ghost Riley out here taking a shower and trying to get her to eat a clean up food that she's hogging in her inventory I don't know why they do that the kids do that a lot Oh, I had that I gave her that pizza last episode when they went to the library the section that I forgot to film which is really weird okay yeah this is really when it's going to happen Dante's gonna come out the shower this time and then look into the mirror and look like an absolute go yeah ghost oh my god I lost even more money twenty four hundred dollars I need to get twenty seven I need to get the $2,700 ASAP so I can buy uh -huh. my okay. stove. Yeah, when Dante comes out, this is really going to be the end of this video because we're almost to 20 27 minutes. Um, yeah, but this is them for now. I still don't have my stove. Um, trying to make some money. And right now, the, okay, so when we start up the next video, you're going to see how I make the garden because now I'm taking stuff from the fridge. No, actually, that's not true. I'm taking stuff from his inventory and put it in the fridge so that it's still good. So, yeah, no violence now. Did you see it? Oh, my God, I missed it. Pause and go back, and then you will see Dante out here looking like a ghost. But thank you so much for watching my video. Bye-bye.